I don't know, one sign says if there's a tsunami you should run, the other one says there's slow pedestrians crossing down here. I don't know what the slow pedestrians are supposed to do when the tsunami comes. <laughs> Double hook up, baby. There you go. What? <laughs> this one says, I want to get in there. <laughs> So this may not be the way you do fish dumplings, but this is the way we're doing it today. And I have full confidence it will be incredible. So, let's do this thing. <gasps> we have to plug it in first. <laughs> <laughs> that, make, that makes it work better. Okay, <laughs> round two, let's do this thing. Uh, I don't know what just happened there. There we go. So we're going to add some sesame oil, just a little bit. And vegetable oil. Vegetable oil? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. That's about right. Yeah. We're winging it. Yeah. That looks good. So what is it that you're looking for? The consistency to make it kind of like, like this. <laughs> <laughs> what does like this mean? It's, it's like fluffy, fluffy, but we need it to be more glistening. Glistening. So it needs more oil. Okay. And then it needs to like bind up on itself sort of. Ooh. Well, <laughs> we can dump some of that off. Nah, yeah. it's gonna be fine. Cause we're adding a bunch of other stuff, so. Yeah, that's okay. good. That's what you're looking for. Right? Yeah. Okay. okay. So it's like fish paste. Yeah. Glistening with oil. Just a dash of the sesame oil and then a bit more vegetable oil. And that's, we're not just using sesame oil because if we did, it would totally overpower it, right? Yeah. yeah. So now you're adding green onion, cilantro. Yeah, this is cilantro. Awesome. Looks bad, right? More green onion than cilantro because 
because. All right. Got some ginger? Yeah. Grated ginger? Yeah. Okay. And then uh, let's just see what it looks like. Yep, this looks good. See, you want it to stick together. Yeah, I totally see. Yeah. And then I would say let's add the egg white like we did last time. Okay. Because it'll help it bind. Okay, we're just having fun in the kitchen today, ladies and gentlemen. So we got some white pepper and uh, what else are we adding? Salt. And salt. It's pretty easy. You know, just use less salt. Sauce. <laughs> sauce. Use less sauce if it's salty. So cooking one? Cooking rice wine, I think. And soy sauce? Yeah. Just a little bit. Because we already put salt. You don't want to chop it too fine either. Mm. Because if you chop it too fine, then it won't stay together. And you kind of want the meat to stay together. Alright, so we got fish, we got pork, we're adding ginger, and then we're going to add chives. Chinese chives? Your mom always says what? Just a little bit of sugar makes it taste better. So Diane just added about an eighth of a teaspoon, barely any sugar. Look, this is a good size, because then everybody can get a bite. God, why do you always film like, the ugliest ones? The ugliest. Look at this. No. No. Oh my god. Oh, shame. The, sh the humiliation. What's this half? Don't know. Probably pork and chive and fish. 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 I'll just assume this is fish. Perfect. This is this is the second round that has been done. Because we already ate the first the round. The first round was really pretty and this is still really pretty. Like, but we forgot. We can't do it wrong. Now we're gonna give you a taste test. Taste test. Delicious. <laughs> Two different types of recipes, one with pork, chive, and fish, mm -hmm. another one with green onion, fish, and some egg white to bind it. Very nice. 
All right, so <clears throat> we have our fish dumplings and our blended fish and pork dumplings that Diane made. Special sauce here. And the sauce, what does it have in there? Uh, cilantro, garlic, green onions, soy sauce, rice vinegar, uh, sesame oil, water, and your mom's homemade chili oil. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Super tasty. We forgot to get the initial taste test. I'm sorry, guys. But now we're going to do it again because it is really good. So Which one? whichever one you want to start with. This one is supposed to be the pork chives and uh, the fish. I go half, you go half. Let's see what the reaction is when it's really hot. Yeah? Hot. Is it? Mm-hmm. Bueno? Bueno. Mm. 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 Yummy. Mm -hmm. The chives come out. Mm. Fish? Mm. The texture is awesome too. A really nice crunch, but then a nice little chewiness. Chewiness? Ch chewy. Chewiness. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. salivating just watching mm -hmm. this mm -hmm. eat one of these too the chili oil is good it's really good yeah the sauce like the whole thing is just fantastic <laughs> mm. mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. so uh oh man oh yeah alex, Damn. alex uh, come over here and get in give here, us man. a taste test what get in here this tell, is alex tell us what you think okay <laughs> that's so. the chive and pork this is fish Okay, so right here we have the chive and pork dumpling, okay? <laughs> Very specially made with care, right? Yeah. yeah, love and care. And without care, these would not be possible, okay? These, <laughs> same thing, all right? These are pork, chicken. Fish. Fish, <laughs> okay? okay? Dude, I can't carry this thing any longer. Very simple. Spear. Dumpling, dip. You see the technique. Mm. Whoa! That's what you want, okay? So that was a fish. This here is the chive, pork, and shrimp dumplings. Fish. <laughs> and fish. Okay. Here's a little technique that you guys might not know. Break it open. Dip. Saturate the entire dumpling. Okay? It's like a water balloon. Mm. That's good. Don't eat them too fast, okay? Otherwise, <laughs> <laughs> don't worry. Okay, okay. Anyway. <laughs> anyway. Oh. So, round two. No, we need to bring these to the rest of the group, or they're gonna be gone. Well, right. well thanks, guys. Gone. Those are delicious. Let's right, do another take. Another yeah. catch and cook, <laughs> California. <laughs> <laughs>